Hello and welcome to Iceland Stamp Unboxing 6. So these three envelopes here uh, came out of um, the giant box of stamps on paper that I received and I took a quick peek at uh, during the mail call episode 1 video. This one looks like it's mostly mint stamps. Now when I get mint stamps in an envelope uh, in a box of random on paper or even off paper i have to uh i generally worry about them being stuck together so i'm sort of expecting that here um, so we're going to start with these uh, but you know they may be stuck together then i'll probably move to these and if there's any room left i might start these i might not um, otherwise i'll save them for another video so let me pick these up here i also switched to a um, black background here actually bought a new laptop the other day and this came um, inside on the keyboard uh, separating the layers and I figured that I might get better lighting response if I were to switch to a black background so just dump these out here and yep they do appear to be mint that's a nice one with a um, person holding holding a child with a, a dog walking at the at their feet uh, see and that's what I expected we are clumped together. Here's a used one, so I guess they're not all mint. We've seen that before in the Volcano series of 47. And another clump. Nothing loose coming out of it. Okay, I'm just going to set them completely aside, and I'll manage these on my own time, I guess. Yeah, they're stuck. Okay. Well, so much for that. There actually actually seems to be one more stamp still in the envelope I didn't notice. So there we go. There's that one. And I'll get into the small pack now. Now here's some older stuff. I don't I haven't done a lot of older stuff in my videos so far, so really nice to see. Scott number eleven, eight fifty. I'll have to look some of these up. Another probably done. Looks like maybe a dam or hydroelectric power. I'll have to look up this series. Scott number 108, $1.25. Scott number 174, $1.25. Geyser. And here's the wrestling part of the wrestling series. That one is mint, but unfortunately written the catalog number on the back. I don't mind so much when they do that on a used stamp, but uh, it's unfortunate they've done it to a mint stamp. See, they don't all have the catalog number. So, some prior owner thought that was a good way. Scott number 72, $1.75. I'm really excited to see some of these older definitives as my collection doesn't have many of them. That's great. Okay, looks like we have plenty of real estate left. I will uh, go ahead and take a pinch out of this next envelope. I'm just going back for a second dip here. As I see, we have another one of that series. Mountain. Put that there. Another one of a harbor. It's a famous person. You know, we're getting into the point where we've seen some of these in prior videos. There's a used version of that stamp. Because I'm getting uh, sets from different people and they're not guaranteed to be all unique. I'm also to a point in my collection where. Uh, I need fewer and fewer, so I'm more likely to find duplicates. I really like these two stamps here. The ships in the harbor. Actually, it looks like it's the same exact picture, just slightly different coloring. It's got 338 and 339, 30 cents and 50 cents. 
Here's this one. Oops, I've just moved my screen. Let me sheet and push it back into place. No, nope, not in. I didn't see a cancel clearly. Oh, the cancel's in the corner. Very, very faint actual circle cancel. Here we go from 1963. Semi postal, 3 plus 50. And uh, looks like an ambulance. And this looks like the exact same. Uh, different color. Interesting. These two are semi postals. B17 and B18, both are $1.40 used. There's 1968, it looks like a library. Here's the counterpart to the first set of ships there. Famous person for Kroner. Scott, 402, 25 cents. And here it looks like another library stamp, in a different denomination. Scott number 400, 20 cents. Scott number 401, 90 cents. Here we have a loon. I'm sure that has a different name in Icelandic, but here in the United States we call those loons. Here is a flower. I don't have this one yet, I don't believe. 1967, five kroner. Scott number 392, 25 cents. Here's one of the Europa designs. I'll try to fit that uh, maybe here. Wow, that's a great cancel on that. 1968 stamp, 1968. Spot on the nose, cancel. Scott number 398, 20 cents. I mean, that cancel is so clear. Looks like the same stamp again, with very light corner cancel. There's another 68. Uh, looks like this might be... No, I don't know if it's the same series or not. No, it doesn't look like it. Here's another Europa stamp. And it's mate. These typically come in pairs. And here's some landscapes. Scott number 383, 35 cents. Very nice. I don't know if they're just considered landscapes or whether these ones are a mountain series. Maybe not a mountain because now I have one that looks not mountainous. Scott number 381, 35 cents. And here's another one of those 68 stamps. I'm just going to put it over here covering them. Here is a woman in a dress. Scott number 379, $9. There's another Europa. I'll set this one down here. This looks like a hole in the ice. Oh, it's probably the top of a volcano. Okay, because this looks like the same hole. Scott number 374 and Scott number 373, both 65 cents each. With some uh, smoke and lava. Probably part of the same series here as the fonts look similar even though it's a vertical stamp. And then Iceland. Scott 370, 60 cents. Put these out of the way. 1965, uh, UIT. Here's another flower. I'll just set it here for now. Here's another Europa. And it's mate. Okay, I'm deciding I don't really care for this paper as it's that is this black background because it's too clingy. Otherwise, I actually really like it. Scott, 367, 65 cents. Scott, 368, one dollar. I'll have to find another material. Pull out a few more. Just until I've filled the area. So, there's a pair. Scott, 
20 cents. Scott, 361, 30 cents. These look like the reissue, a commemorative reissue of these older ones based on the dual dates and 1961 date there. I think I've seen the blue one before. Scott, 333, 20 cents. A couple more flowers. Grab another small pinch here. Certainly seen this one before. That's a pretty good cancel as well. Not quite complete, but not bad looking. Got three five six twenty cents. That's a nice good picture of Greenland there. Scott three fifty fifty five cents. Looks like some kind of air or sea route. Famous person. Looks like some stone artwork. And here's a building. I'm not sure of the significance. And another building. And another one in that same set. The set of three buildings is Scott 345 through 347. The first building is the Production Institute, the second is the Fishing Research Institute, and the third is the Farm Bureau. Uh, they're 25 cents, 25 cents, and 30 cents, respectively. And here we have a seabird feeding its young, semi-postal 19 plus 1. I have another of that set right here in the bag. It's got B23 and B24. These are $1.10 each. i grab just a couple more stamps here. I have a couple nice airplanes. Scott 410 and Scott 411, 55 cents each. And I'll reach into the bag and pull out another flower to end it off. So this has been episode 6. Uh, if you've enjoyed this, uh, please consider subscribing. And I'll hope to have another episode soon. Thanks for watching.